Hi guys, today I'm showing you how to clean your RAM in Windows. So this file, so all you're going to need is download this file right here. It's called RAM Cleaner. And it's actually a pretty large file, but it is not as large as it could be because, well, I had to um, zip it. So you do need WinRAR. You can download it on their website. Let's go online and search for... WinRAR. All right. So once you found um, the WinRAR archiver, you can download it. Let's go to their website. Downloads. Um. There. And you can download the um language you're in, or you can just download their beta. The well, betas are fine. So the betas are reliable. But um, you're going to find what these files are here in the RAM cleaner. Um, you're going to need to extract it according to your architecture. And architecture depend upon how your operating system was installed. So what you need to do is you need to go in your settings. And by the way, I'm running in Windows 8. So uh, you need to go in your control panel and system and security and system. Um, and then look down at system type, and this will be it, your operating system and your processor. Be sure that both of these are 64 or x86. If one of them is 64 and one of them is x86, just do x86 because um, we don't want to ruin the system. So um, mine is 64, so I'm going to click on the 64 one and go on WinRAR. And I'm going to extract the files. I'm going to put it on my desktop. And, you know, quick extraction. Not much in here. But this is the 3 gigabyte file. So we need to extract this too. But we're not going to click. We're going to go extract it somewhere else. So follow me as I, fo as I show you where to extract it. You're going to go to local disk. Program files or x86 depending upon your architecture. Since I'm 64, I'm going to go to the program files and go common files. I know, sorry. You go to program files and that's it. Um, you hit OK and it's going to ask you to um, let changes to the computer since we are in the root of the PC. We are going to. Alright, sorry. So, what did it extract? And I already have it, as you notice, it said I already have these files. So, because I didn't want to waste your time. So, um, this is going to take a while because this, that file is 3 gigabytes. So, we'll just put that aside right there. And you're going to end up with this file. Um, right here, 64. Alright, so you just open that. And you're presented with the CMD runtime and the CS script runtime. These two runtimes are for that file we extracted to our base system in the root. So all we all the really thing is the this is the file VB script file or VBS. So um, what you're gonna do is you're gonna right click it or open with command prompt, and it's gonna clean your RAM. And there you go. It cleans your RAM. It only takes like five seconds. So, you know, you don't have to do that whole process a million times. And if you want it on your desktop, you cannot just simply drag it. Because you need to keep this folder. This folder is, that folder is very important. Because it has the um, CS script runtime and the CMD runtime. So all you're going to do is create a shortcut. Bros. Um, go to RAM Cleaner. I don't know, 64. And click on RAM Cleaner version 1.0, next. And you can rename it to whatever you want. Who cares? But I'm just going to leave it the same. And every time you want to clean your RAM, you're going to right-click it and open with command prompt. There. It cleans it. Takes only th five seconds. And boom. You got your RAM cleaned. And, you know, you really don't have to worry about anything. So, um, that's it. Um. If you want to know where to download this, this is in my um, website. I had that in the description, and um, that will be it. That's it. Stay tuned for more videos.
And um, also check out my website, like and subscribe. I don't care. I don't care what you do. Uh, if you have any questions, you can comment or email me at kidcoder25 at gmail.com. Or you can just um, send me a shoot on my website. Go to contact me in my website. That's in the description. And that's it. And um, that, And goodbye, everybody.